Today, I'm doing a Minecraft mob battle with my girlfriend, but we'll be using skibbity mobs. And what my girlfriend Zoe doesn't know is I set up this one-way glass wall so I can see exactly what skibbity mobs she spawns. Well, anyway, Zoe, are you excited for today's skibbity mob battle? And wait, why are you so big? I am super excited, but Dax, how do you know I'm big? Oh, uh, I could just hear your steps stomping around, but you're gonna have five minutes to spawn in your mobs. Best of luck, Zoe. Good luck, Dax. Okay, guys, and now we're on to the very first round of our skibbity mob battle. And of course, I set up this huge one-way glass wall so I can see exactly what Zoe's gonna spawn in. So let's see, what is she gonna try and do for this first round? I am so excited to beat Dax this first round. I need to look at my chest and see what mobs I can spawn in. I really doubt she has anything good in her chest, guys. My people are totally gonna crush her. This one's called the astronaut toilet. Whoa, this guy's super cool. What the heck? Wait, she has the astronaut toilet off the jump? Look how spooky this guy looks. And of course, I'm gonna spawn in a whole bunch of them so I can build a super strong army that defeats Dax. Oh my god. Gosh, guys, Zoe always spawns in a whole bunch of them, which makes this a lot more complicated. But don't worry, I can think of something really good. Let's see what's in our chest. Oh, and wait a second. This might be the perfect counter to Zoe's mobs. If I spawn in the Titan Speaker Man for the first round, there's probably no way that Zoe's army could actually beat us. So let me go ahead and spawn in one of these guys. And whoa, this guy is so huge. Look at this. He has his rocket launcher jetpack, and he has two different cannons on him, and he's like 50 feet tall. This is awesome. Let me go ahead and spawn in a big army of these guys so they can completely crush Zoe's. And oh, wait a second. Why in the world is there a chicken in our army? He is carrying the Titan Speaker Man around. What in the world? And actually, I do have one really good idea. Somewhere over here, I should have a hidden chest with something really cool inside. And perfect. Look, there it is. Let's go ahead and see what I have. And wait, I have a cake. What in the world am I going to do with a cake? It's literally just cake. Well, I did hear once a long time ago, if you feed your army cake, they'll get super big and strong. So maybe if I put down a bunch of cake, they'll all just transform to be huge giants. And oh, wait a second. What in the the world just happened. My army just got super small. I am literally the same height as all my Titan speaker men. Okay, that definitely didn't work. Whoever told me that is a complete and utter liar. <sighs> well, I guess it isn't that big deal. After all, they are Titan speaker men, so they should be able to defeat Noe's army, no problem. But what do you guys think? Who's gonna win this first round? You can either comment Team Speaker Man or you can comment Team UFO. Okay, Zoe, well, I think my army is basically ready to go for this first round. Are you ready for me to drop the walls? I am beyond ready. You are so going down. Well, let's see about that, Zoe. The walls have officially dropped. Uh, Dax, why is there so much cake on the ground? Uh, well, someone told me a long time ago that cake makes your army strong, but it really just made my guy super short. Yeah, Dax, the cake just shrinks your army. Didn't you know that? Well, obviously not, Zoe. That's why I put down a bunch of cake, but it looks like it doesn't even matter. My tight speaker better going to work on all your UFO toilets. That's true. They're like easily picking my guys up and everything. This is not good. Come on, guys. Keep beating them up. Show Zoe that size doesn't matter and you can still win this. But you really didn't even spawn in that many people, Dax. I don't know if you're going to win this. Oh, come on. I have total faith in my Titan Speaker Man. They could definitely pull this out. This is just chaos in the middle, but it looks like my Titan Speaker Man are going to work. You only have one guy left and boom, Zoe. It looks like I won this first round in the mob battle. You're a loser. What the heck? I thought for sure I was going to win with my astronaut toilets. Well, definitely not, Zoe. They obviously completely suck, which makes me the champion of the mob battle. Nuh-uh. You're not the champion of the mob battle. You're just the champion of the first round. The second round and the third round, I'm going to win. Okay, we'll see about that, Zoe. Let's move on to round number two. Two. And perfect, guys. Just like I told you, we totally won that first round, which makes me the ultimate mob battle player ever. But of course, I need to win the second round as well. So let's go ahead and spy through the glass and see what Zoe's doing. And wait, why in the world is she on a computer right now? So it looks like the research says that the glitch toilet is sure to deliver a win during a mob battle. Let's see if my chest has one. Wait, did she just say a glitch toilet was the one that was told that was going to win the mob battle? What the heck? She can't use the internet. And I have one. Yippee, it's my lucky day. What in the world? These guys are so creepy. Ew, the glitch toilet looks kind of gross. Yeah, these glitch toilets are kind of weird looking, but I know that they're super powerful, so I'm going to spawn in a whole bunch of them. Okay, guys, I can't believe she used the internet. That is absolutely cheating, but don't worry. I can think of something good regardless. Let's just look at our chest and see what we got. And ooh, this one looks cool. It says the scientist toilet. If you didn't know, the scientist toilet is extremely strong, so I bet if I spawn him in, I could totally crush Zoe's army. Let's see what this guy looks like. And whoa, this guy looks really, really freaky. Hey, you, don't call me freaky. Whoa, 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 wait, what the heck? You can talk? Well, yeah, of course I can talk. I am a skibbity toilet leader after all. What in the world? That doesn't even mean you can talk. I've never even heard of anything like that before. Well, you've heard of it now, so what are we gonna do about it? Uh, well, probably nothing. 
I need you to help me beat all those glitch toys over there. I should probably spawn in a bunch more of you guys. No, 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 you stupid green man. You better not spawn in more. Wait, what in the world? Why can't I spawn in more scientist toilets? You really think you need more than just me in order to beat Zoe's army? Uh, well, yeah, yeah, I do think I need more than just you. You stupid human. I'm all you need. Okay, man, take it easy. If you think that you're all that I need in order to beat Zoe's army, I guess I can always just spawn in you. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay, guys, this scientist toilet is super weird. I'm gonna kind of just leave him alone and let him do his own thing. Well, even if I can't spawn in more people, maybe I could think of something really good that could help me out. And what the heck is this guy building? Hey, you stupid scientist toilet. What in the world are you doing? Hey, you, what are you talking to me like that for? Why are you building this random stuff on my site? This is a mob battle. Well, considering I'm one of your mobs, I can do whatever I want in order to get the victory. Okay, well, that honestly might be true. But what the heck even is this? Well, once I'm done with my contraption, all of Zoe's mobs will become flat. Wait, did you just say all of her mobs will become flat? What in the world does that even mean? What in the world is that even gonna do? You stupid human, just wait and see. Uh, okay, well, while you're doing that, I'm gonna head over here. Just let me know when you're done, I guess. Okay, guys, this scientist toilet is really weird, but he said all of Zoe's mobs are gonna get flat. I wonder what he means by that. Okay, human, I'm done. Okay, you said you're done. I wanna see what the world this thing does, and whoa, there's a lot more blocks this time around. Well, yeah, I am the scientist after all. I'm a super big genius. Well, okay, you might be a genius, but what in the world is this thing you're supposed to do? Well, in the back of here, I have a little button, and basically, once you press this button, all of her army's gonna get super small. Okay, I really don't believe you, but I guess I can go ahead and flick it and see what it does. Yeah, go ahead and flick it whatever you want. And, uh, wait a second. Did it actually work? Well, of course it worked. I'm the one that built it. What in the world? Look at all of Zoe's mobs. They're so flat now. What in the world? Why are all my mobs flat? Oh my gosh, guys. This is so funny. Look how flat Zoe's mobs are. I bet she's so annoyed right now. This is not good, but maybe they're still just as powerful. <laughs> what? She thinks they're as strong as they were before? Look at that. They look so stupid. There's no way they could be nearly as powerful. Okay, well, it definitely looks like her army's destroyed over there. Let me go ahead and talk to Mr. Scientist Toilet. Hey, Mr. Scientist Toilet, is there anything else you can do to make sure we win this round? Oh, don't worry, Dax. I actually have one thing up my sleeve that I'm gonna press once the walls drop. Uh, okay, he has one thing up his sleeve. I wonder what that's gonna do, but I totally trust you now that I saw this. Yeah, you better trust me, you stupid human. And actually, why he's still building that, maybe I should look at Zoe's side real quick. And of course, in order to get over there, I'm gonna need to grab myself an invisibility potion, and then I can just splash it on myself so I can walk over there. Let's go ahead and see what she's up to. And oh my gosh, guys, we're over to Zoe's side. And look at her army. This is so funny. Look how flat they are. And wait, what in the world is Zoe doing over here? I guess I can't do anything about my army. So I'm just going to plant a garden. Oh my gosh, guys, she's actually planting a garden in the middle of a mob battle. That is actually really, really funny. What's something I could do to mess with her a little bit though? Oh, wait a second. I have the perfect idea. What if I grab this one dynamite called the lightning dynamite and then throw it down? Let's just go ahead and throw this lightning down in the middle and oh my gosh look at that what the heck was that lightning that is super weird okay guys it doesn't even look like it affected zoe that much since she thinks it was just normal lightning so what if i go ahead and throw a few different sticks of dynamite what the heck is going on it's almost like the game is glitching oh it must be my glitch toilets that makes total sense wait she thinks her glitch toilets are glitching out and it's causing all the lightning that is a little bit weird well i think my glitch toilets are probably gonna need some help so i think i'm gonna spawn in the zombie toilet. Wait, did she just say she's going to spawn in the zombie toilet? What in the world even is that? And ew, these guys are so gross. Whoa, these guys are weirder looking than the freaking glitch toilets. This is going to be awesome. Oh my gosh, guys, this is not looking good for me. Well, now that we have like 30 seconds left, I think I'm just going to relax because the walls are going to drop any second now. Wait, guys, did Zoe just say that there's only 30 seconds left? Oh gosh, quick, let me get back over to my side. Let me just drink a bucket of milk and wait a second, what in the world is a scientist toilet doing? Hey, Mr. Scientist Toilet, what in the world are you doing? Why is there a piece of TNT here? Well, this is what I'm using in order to destroy Zoe's army. Dude, that is totally gonna destroy our whole platform. Are you stupid or something? No, just trust me, Dax. I know what I'm doing. Uh, okay, whatever. It doesn't even matter. Okay, Zoe, I think there's only like 10 seconds left until the walls drop. Are you ready for this round? I am so ready. You're totally going down. Just wait until the walls drop. Dax, why did you spawn in only one guy? Oh, this is the scientist toilet, and he said he could actually take out your whole army by himself. Yeah, I don't know if that's true. It seems pretty unlikely for one guy to defeat my whole army. Dax, who is this dumb purple girl talking to? Just watch this. Dax, you're gonna let this guy call your girlfriend dumb? Where in the world does TNT just go? What in the world did you do, scientist toilet? What's that noise? Just wait, Dax. Everything's under control. Zoe, what in the world just happened? My scientist toilet just blew up everything. Yeah, Dax, that really wasn't a smart idea to trust an evil scientist. And wait a second. Some of your glitch toys are still alive. How is this even possible? And you know what that means. Oh my gosh. I guess you got the round win. This stupid scientist toilet. And wait, where in the world did he even go? He probably died in the explosion. 
explosion. I didn't trust that guy from the start. Oh my gosh, whatever. Okay, I guess you could have that round win, Zoe. Let's just move on to the next round. Woohoo, I'm the winner. Guys, what in the world just happened? I can't believe the scientist toilet just got the whole platform blown up and he even blew up himself. That guy's such an idiot. Ugh, whatever, let me just go ahead and see what Zoe's gonna do for this next round and I can win this round all by myself. I am so stoked that I beat Dax. I'm really gonna win this entire mob battle. This round, I think I'm gonna spawn in the TV woman because she's one of my favorite Skibbity characters. Wait, did Zoe just spawn in the TV woman? Whoa, she actually looks super, super powerful. And you know what's better than one TV woman? A bunch of TV women. Oh my gosh. And she is of course spawning in a whole bunch of them, guys. But don't worry, guys. I can definitely think of something super good to take them all out. Let's just go ahead and think of something good to spawn in. And wait a second, the scientist toilet, what are you doing back here? Oh, hey, Dax, how's it going? What, don't hey, Dax, me? You just made me lose that last round are you dumb or something hey man it was a malfunction in my experiment it totally wasn't my fault Ugh, whatever well what are you doing back here anyways if you want to trust me for one more round i actually have something really good that could help you out trust you for one more round uh i don't know you already kind of got me screwed over just trust me dax i have something super good on my sleeve okay well what is it i'm gonna make you a combining machine so you can combine two different skibbity bobs to get an ultra one whoa wait that actually sounds kind of cool how are you even gonna build it oh we'll just watch this whoa wait what in the world did you just make this combining machine? Well, yeah, of course I did. I am the scientist toilet after all. Okay, this is pretty sick, but wait, what mobs am I even supposed to use? Go ahead and use all three of these spawn eggs, and then you can get the ultimate skibbity character. Wait, all three of these spawn eggs? Let's see. We got the Titan speaker man, the upgraded TV man, and we also got the upgraded cameraman. Are you sure about this scientist toilet? Oh, yeah. Have I ever been wrong before? Uh, yeah, you were actually wrong last round, but I guess I can try this out. So it looks like I need to go over here, and then I can spawn in the cameraman, and let's also spawn in the speaker man on this side. And then I can just run over to this other side and then I can spot on the upgraded TV man. And I guess all I have to do is flick the lever and let's see what it ends up doing. And whoa, wait a second. Did I just make the tri-tide scientist toilet? You're such a genius. And wait, where in the world did he just go? Okay, it looks like the scientist toilet just disappeared again. But all the combination of all those titans got us the tri titan who's supposed to be like one of those strongest characters ever. Let's go ahead and grab this guy's spawn egg. And then I can spot on a whole bunch of them. And wait, are Zoe's glitch toilet still down there? Oh gosh, those are really, really creepy. But like I said, I'm gonna spot on a bunch of these guys. So let me go ahead and start placing them all down. Okay, guys, in perfect. Now that my whole army is entirely built out, we should probably go check up on Zoe and see what she's doing. And wait, why does she have a house here? And wait, is that a pool? Perfect. My house is complete and I even put a pool in for me. Wait, why in the world does she have a house? And why did she even build a pool? This is a mob battle after all. Okay, guys, we cannot allow her to have this much fun. So why don't I prank her real quick? And I actually have this one mod that allows me to transform into any character I want. And right now, I want to transform into the TV woman so I can prank Zoe. And since they look like all of her characters over there, I can just walk over to her side without even getting noticed. Okay, guys, and perfect. I made it over to her side, and we look just like all the TV women. Oh my gosh, I can't believe Zoe's actually relaxing inside of a pool in the middle of a mob battle. This is just insane. Wow, I am so happy that I made this pool because I am relaxing and having so much fun. You know what, guys? Let's go ahead and mess with her real quick, and I think what we should do is grab something called fake water. And now if I just walk over here and place a bunch of it on the ground, she'll start taking a bunch of damage inside of her pool. What the heck? Why am I drowning? It seems like I'm getting hurt from the water. Oh my gosh, guys. And look, it looks like she just realized that the water hurt her. This is so funny. And wait, it just took her out? What the heck? My water killed me. This is the worst pool ever. Hey, Zoe, uh, the chat just said that you died of poisonous water. Is everything okay over there? No, nothing's okay. I built a pool and it ended up killing me. Wait, Zoe, you said you built a pool in the middle of the mob battle. What in the world is wrong with you? Nothing's wrong with me. I just wanted to relax. And wait, the pool took you out. How in the world did it do that? I have no clue, but this is the first time it's ever happened to me. Uh, Zoe, let me ask you a question real quick, okay? What is it? When is the last time you clean the water in your pool? Clean the water? What are you talking about? Zoe, you have to clean the water like every week, otherwise it gets super poisonous. What? I've had this pool forever and it's never done that and nobody's ever told me that. Well, Zoe, you have to clean the pool water. You should probably go ahead and work on that. Okay, I'll start working on that. Let me go into my house and see if I have any pool cleaner lying around. Oh, guys, this is perfect. Zoe went inside our house, which means I could mess with her a bit more. Last time we actually use this fake water, but now I think I'm gonna use this fake lava, which actually heals you if you go in it. Let me just go ahead and fill it all in with this fake lava, and this should be perfect. Once she comes back outside, she's gonna be so confused. Okay, Dax, I found some pool cleaner, so I just need to splash it on 
the water? What the heck? Why is my pool full of lava? Oh my gosh, guys. She sees all the lava. Uh, Zoe, did you just say your pool's full of lava? Yes. Is that pretty normal? Uh, Maybe you're colorblind. Maybe it actually is water. First, my pool kills me and now I'm colorblind? What am I going to do? Okay, Zoe, wait. We don't know if you're colorblind yet. How about we do a little test real quick? How do you want me to test it? Well, why don't you just go ahead and jump into that stuff you're calling lava and see if it really is lava? Okay, here goes nothing. What? I'm not even dying. I guess I really am colorblind. Oh gosh, Zoe, it must be water after all. You really are going colorblind. This isn't good. What am I going to do, Dax? How am I going to see my favorite color purple ever again? Uh, I don't know, Zoe, but I'm going to head back to my side and finish up my army while you deal with that stuff. Go back on your side? What do you mean? Uh, nothing, Zoe. Let's just get ready for the round to start. Oh my gosh, guys, wait, that was way too close. I almost just gave away my secret, but I think we kind of convinced Zoe that she's going colorblind, so that is pretty funny after all. But like we said, the walls are about to drop, so who do you guys think is going to win? You can either comment Team Tri-Titan or you can comment Team TV Woman. Okay, Zoe, well, I'm pretty sure the walls are about to drop. Are you ready for this next round? I am ready and I am colorblind. Yeah, Zoe, I can't believe you're actually colorblind, but let's see how this next round turns out. What the heck? This is Mayhem. Is that a Tri-Titan? Yes, this is the Tri-Titan. He's a combination of all three Skibbity Titans and he's ultra powerful. This is not going to be good for my TV women. Come on, guys. We can totally beat up all the TV women. And wait, Zoe, why do you have a house here? Because I got bored after I spawned in all my TV women, so I built a house. Uh, that's a little bit confusing, but whatever. I guess it really doesn't make that big of a difference since you're losing anyways. So, am I really losing? Uh, I mean, it looks like it's losing. Zoe, you're colorblind. Not completely blind. You can see the fight. Oh, no. What the heck? I thought I was going to win. Hey, why are your Tri-Titans after me? Oh, gosh. Wait, they're jumping you too? Oh, no, Zoe. It looks like you're about to lose too. Ha <laughs> ha. No, I'm going to start killing your guys. Uh, Zoe, it doesn't look like you're going to be able to do that. I think you're definitely going to lose. No, I still have half a heart left. You only have half a heart? Yeah, you are totally going down. What if I just go ahead and push you back in and wait, what? You got stuck inside of there? Oh, man, but one of them got left in. Yeah, it looks like he did get let in, Zoe, but I think your army lost that round, which means the score is now two to one. That's okay, because there's still a few rounds left for me to win, and then I can be the mob battle champion. I doubt it, Zoe. Let's move on to round number four. In perfect, guys, we completely crushed Zoe in that last round, which means I only need one round left in order to win. So let's go ahead and spy through our one-way glass and see what Zoe's gonna try and pull off for this next round. For this fourth round, I'm gonna spawn in the upgraded Titan cameraman. Wait, did she just spawn in the upgraded Titan cameraman? Whoa, this guy actually looks pretty cool. And this guy's supposed to be super OP, so I'm gonna spawn in a whole bunch of them. Okay, guys, she is spawning in a whole bunch of them, but honestly, I don't really think it makes that big of a difference. Well, I'm guessing if Zoe wants to spawn in the upgraded Titan cameraman, I should probably spawn in the upgraded Titan TV man. Let's go ahead and put this guy down over here, and oh my gosh, look how big this guy is. He looks so overpowered, and I'm sure once I spawn in a bunch of them, they're gonna completely wipe Zoe's army off the face of the map. So let's go ahead and spawn in a few more. And wait a second, it says error limit reached. What the heck does that mean? Oh no, guys, I can't even spawn in any more mobs. What in the world am I gonna do? I've never seen a limit error reach before, but uh huh, I have to think of something. And wait a second, what if I built a nether portal to go talk to one of my friends? I'm sure he could help me out. Let me just go ahead and build a portal just like this. And then all I have to do is light it up, and now I can go inside and talk to one of my friends. And oh my gosh, guys, look, it looks like we made it to this Skibbity Dom dimension. And wow, he has so many diamonds and gold. This guy is so rich. But hey, Skibbity Dom, how's it going? Oh, hey, Dax. I haven't seen you in a minute. What the heck? Wait, what happened to your voice? Are you sick or something? Oh, yeah. I've been super sick the past few days, so my voice is a little bit screwed up. Uh, okay. Well, I'm gonna need a little bit of help in a mob battle if you can help me out again. What seems to be the problem? Well, I tried to spawn in more than one mob, but it really didn't go well. The system said I couldn't spawn in any more, so I need to get my guy all OP and stuff. Oh, you need to get your guy OP. Well, I have just the thing inside of this chest. Oh, inside of this chest right here? Well, can I go in? Of course you can, and it's super good stuff for you. Okay, well, let's see what you got in here and whoa what is this it says the op mob book but wait it says protection four what in the world is that don't worry about that protection four part it's actually just super strong if you click on any of your characters they'll get ultra ultra enchanted uh okay skimmy dop i'm gonna trust you and just go back to the mob arena i hope you get better best of luck dax guys that was super weird but i mean at least he gave us his op mob book i've never heard of something like this before but let's go ahead and click on this guy and see what it does and whoa look at this he's super shiny and glow now. And since he's all shiny and glowy, it might actually be true that he's going to be ultra overpowered. I'm pretty sure this guy can take out all of Zoe's army himself. I mean, look how big and tall and strong he is. In perfect, I think now I'm basically ready for the wall strap. My army is going to be so powerful. Okay, now I just need to splash some of this OP potion on some of my mobs so they can get super powerful. Wait, what did Zoe just say? Where in the world is she? She's just splashing an OP potion on her mobs. What in the world is she even doing? She 
said that's an OP potion? Guys, this is super weird, but don't worry. I'm pretty sure Skimmy Dob has us in the back and I can totally win this. Hey, Zoe, are you ready for the wall to drop for this next round? Heck yeah, I'm ready to win. And here we go. It looks like the fourth round and our mob battle has officially begun. Whoa, why is your guy glowing? Because he's super ultra powered. I got an OP potion that I actually used on him. Hey, I have an OP potion too. Wait, where in the world did you get that OP potion from? My friend Skibbity Bob. Wait, Skibbity Top, he gave me one too. What the heck? That two-timey weasel. Oh my gosh, this is so messed up, but I still think my TV man can pull off this round win. Come on, my tight TV man can totally win this. You're gonna lose the mob battle once and for all, Zoe. No way. I have so many more mobs than you. Just wait and see. My Titan TV man can totally win this and what the heck? He just got taken out. What were you saying, Dex? Your Titan TV man can totally take what? Oh my gosh. Whatever, Zoe. The score is only two to two. I'm totally gonna beat you in this last round. Don't get too confident. Dex, I'm definitely gonna win the tiebreaker and I'll be the mob battle champion. Guys, what in the world? I can't believe Skimmy Top actually betrayed us and helped that Zoe in that last round. That totally wasn't fair. But I totally need to win this last round in order to be the mob battle champion. So hopefully I can think of something really good to take out Zoe's army with. Let's see what she's gonna try and do. For this last and final round, I'm gonna spawn in all of my old mobs. Wait, did she just say she's gonna spawn in all of her old mobs? You know what? That's actually not too bad of an idea. Zoe's kind of smart. With an army this big and this diverse, there's no way that Dax is gonna win. Okay, guys, Zoe might actually be right unless I do the same exact thing that she did. Let's go ahead and start spawning in a bunch of my mobs because I totally wanted to destroy it in that last round. And wait a second, it looks like that limiter kind of went away. I can just spawn in as many as I want now. This is perfect. Okay, let me go ahead and spawn in some tight speaker man like this, and this is probably gonna be the craziest round ever. Who do you think is gonna win this final round? You can either comment Team Dax or you can comment Team Zoe. Okay, Zoe, I think my army is basically ready to go for this final round, and just let me tell you, you're about to lose once and for all. Yeah, I seriously doubt that. My army is super powerful, but let's go ahead and drop the wall and let's see. Well, here we go. The walls have officially dropped. Let's see if you can back up all that trash talking. I surely will. And wait a second, Zoe, it looks like you spotted all of your old mobs. That's honestly a pretty good idea. Yeah, and it looks like you did the same. Your your mobs are super big. Yeah, my mobs are super big and super strong. I don't think there's any chance you could actually pull this round out. You never know, Dax. I can definitely still win. Come on, guys. We have to win this. We cannot lose to Zoe. And whoa, a bunch of people are dropping now. I have no idea who's even winning. What the heck? A lot of people are dropping. This is not good for me. This is such a close round, man. All your mobs are so tiny. It's like impossible to tell. Yeah, and your guys are so big. So actually, my guys are dodging them quite easily. No way. I think my people can still pull this out. I have a bunch of tiny TV men and a bunch of tiny speed it after all. Yeah, but I still think that I can win. Come on, Team Zoe, you got this. Uh, Zoe, I don't think you have that many people left. They're all inside the house and they're all getting jumped. This is not good. And wait, I think that might have been your last person, Zoe. I think I officially won the mob battle. Dang it. I really thought I was going to win this time. Ha, <laughs> Zoe, your army completely sucked. And of course, I'm the mob battle champion once again. Whatever, Dax. And if you guys enjoyed that video and want to watch more Dax and Zoe, make sure to click one of the videos on screen. Bye, guys.